Hey y'all, it's Barbara and Tim, and we are in Weber's Falls, Oklahoma, and we're on the site where the memorial is for a bridge collapse, and uh, I'll just read a bit for you, and then we'll go over and look at the memorial. The I-40 bridge disaster was a bridge collapse that occurred southeast of Weber's Falls, Oklahoma, United States, at 7.45 a.m., on May the 26, 2002, freight barges being transpo transported on the Arkansas River collided with a pier supporting the Interstate 40 road bridge crossing the river. The resulting failure of the supports caused a section of the bridge to collapse, killing 14 people and injuring another 11. The collision was determined to have resulted from the Captain of the barge, the barge's towboat, losing unconsciousness. I don't know what happened to him to make him lose unconsciousness. It doesn't say. But anyway, I'll read this for you. This in loving memory. I don't memory. remember what it was, but I think he had some kind of. He might have had a stroke or something. Uh, I don't I, remember. We do not know. In loving memory of our friends and family family members lost in the I-40 bridge tragedy of May 26, 2002, Weber's Falls, Oklahoma, dedicated May 26, 2003. Now, we don't, we, we don't really know, but Tim said he said that he thought he might have had a, a stroke. Is that right, Tim? I, I can't remember. I, you know, we should have looked that up. I forgot about that. But well, I, caught, was looking... I know it was a barge, but I, I think he had a, it was a medical issue that he had going on that created, I mean, one of the greatest tragedies, tragedies on the I-40. And you know? this, and this is that he's showing you is the bridge that's in, the, yeah, in, that's, the, in the background. That's the bridge. And this is the memorial that's dedicated. And we're going to look at these names of all the people. And this is that, I mean, just traveling down the road and we've all been there and we know what it's like. And so we're just going to start right here with Jeannie, Carly. Um, after we look at this memorial, we are going to take you and show you some of the graves at the cemetery of the families. And then we have Andrew, Clements, Jerry, Gillian. Patricia Gillian, and here we have Margaret Green. Here's James Johnson. This is his wife, Misty Johnson. And there's a picture of them. I don't know if you can see that very good. Young couple. And this over here is their three-year-old daughter, Shay Johnson. All three tragically killed that died that morning. Not killed. I just died. They, I mean, it was an accident. Things. This is what happens. It's crazy in life. Harless Martin, Susan Martin, and this is David. And I don't want to mess his name up, so I don't know how to pronounce it. And this is Jean. Here's Gail Shanahan. I think she was a barrel racer. I think that's a guy. Is that a girl? I think it's a guy. I'm not sure. Paul. And so here we are with, uh, on this side of this part of it is Goldie Alley. Max Alley. James. Bill you? I'm not sure how to pronounce that either, I, and I apologize if I messed that up. And this is Richard Colley and Rodney Tidwell. All lost their life that morning. They have some roses here. Somebody comes down. This is a park that was already a park, but they That's put this 
erected this monument here. This is part of the bridge structure that they used. And then they put this angel up here. I don't think it's an angel. I think it's a little girl. Well, it's got wings. Uh, are those wings? Well, maybe it isn't. I don't know. But it's very pretty. It is very pretty, but that is a part that is a part of the bridge that collapsed that morning. And so we're going to go to the cemetery now and show you some uh, graves of some of the families. Hey, y'all, it's Barbara and Tim, and we are in Weber's Falls, Oklahoma. And we're on the site where the memorial is for a bridge collapse. And uh, Okay, y'all, so we are in Spyro, Oklahoma at New Hope Garden of Memories Cemetery. And we're gonna show you a, a grave here of a couple that was killed in the um, um, Weber's Falls bridge collapse. Yeah. A tragic collapse of that bridge, and this is uh, Gillian. This is Jerry Lee. He was born January the 17th of 1944 and died May 26, 2002. And this is his wife, Patricia Nan, August the 3rd, 1944, and died May 26 of 2002. And that bridge collapsed, and they were on their way to Broken Arrow, Oklahoma, to visit their son and his wife. So, it's just a tragic deal. And here they are at rest, not forgotten. No, 2002. That was a day that I think a lot of people either. I mean, they they really. It's funny how you can remember those days and you know where you was at that day. It's like uh, that 9-11 tragedy. So we're off to the next cemetery to see the other graves. And I was at church that morning and um, a lady that I went to church with, her husband and um, son were on their way to visit a college that their son was thinking about attending in the fall and they were like maybe two cars behind that uh, that got stopped so they were like maybe the second car that got stopped and um so it was a real close call she was a little rattled that morning so we're going to go ahead and go now to another cemetery and show you the family the johnson family the husband and wife and their three-year-old daughter Okay, y'all, so we walked all over Oakwood Cemetery in Paris, Arkansas for, what, an hour? We, we were, we, yeah. We found it, though. <laughs> we found it, yes. Yeah. But we are um, at the grave of? Yeah, this is where James and Misty Johnson and their daughter, uh, no, this is, yeah, their daughter was uh, Shay, right? Yeah, so James and Misty and their three-year-old daughter, Shay, are buried. And they're, part of their family is buried here next to them here, Henson. They were on their way to the Tulsa Zoo that morning. Early, I think that was a Sunday morning, wasn't it? But they were on their way. Because I was at church. Yeah, it was a Sunday morning, and they were on their way to the zoo. And, well, so many people. 